Calm right, down. we're going to no move job. this on, Nadia. This is for you. Oh, okay. Yes. Um, this is, uh, well, I don't know if this Korean designer did this especially for you, but we're going to talk <laughs> about it just for you. Who knows? She might have been thinking about you. Um, basically, she sent models uh, down the, the, are she saying she? I don't know if it's he or she. Uh, down the, it's she, was that she, he or she? She, yep. Um, <laughs> down the runway at New York Fashion Week wearing a merkin. A merkin. It's basically a vagina wig. Um, <laughs> that's, that's what it was called yeah. in the whole scheme of things. Okay. Well, what do you reckon? And apparently the intention was to show this acceptance of individuality of the human vagina. Yeah. Does anyone know what that means? No. I don't think Does they look care? very individual because they've all got the same wig on. Yeah. <laughs> we're, we're not allowed to show it, um, but we were, but, we're but, because it's the school holidays. No, I've got one on. But I think it's a bit more sporran than it is. It is. A we, it's got a touch of the sporran about it. You're quite right. There you go. Oh, I, can, I, 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 I quite like this idea. Well, can I, can I speak yes. for a moment and just inject... Just, 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 just for a moment. <laughs> Do we want hard facts and let's pretend we're on Mastermind? Yeah, go on. Right, the use of merkins dates back to the 1450s and they were originally used by prostitutes after shaving their genitalia to cover, to combat pubic lice. Well, that's not why I want one. <laughs> and men would wear them when playing female parts on stage. <laughs> oh.